January 3, 2011, a day which will live in famously. Holly Partridge Flax, otherwise known as Holly, otherwise otherwise known as a living, breathing angel, is engaged to another man. This is freaking me out. I... Okay, let's just switch to the happy video, okay? okay? No, 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 let's push through, we'll do this. Today will either be the best or the worst day of my life. Holly gave AJ an ultimatum, he either proposes by New Year's or they break up. Now, if she's engaged, I'm gonna go crazy and I'm gonna start attacking people. If she's not engaged, in all honesty, I may just burn this whole place to the ground out of happiness. Either way, I am going to need some talking down and nobody talks me down like myself in a video talking me down. Michael, I know what you're thinking. Holly is engaged to somebody else and you wanna kill yourself. That may seem like a good idea, but it's not. <laughs> it's not. Sorry, it sounded like you said, it's snot. I'm so sorry. Okay, so killing yourself. <laughs> I'm just thinking about snot. <laughs> okay, champagne. Happy. Sponge. Sad to soak up my tears. Gummy bears and gummy worms. Bears, sad, worms, happy. Come on, Aaron. Ukuleles. Happy. Sad, something to break. Chocolates. For you, job well done. Thank you. And two bottles of scotch. Both sad. And did you get the tickets? I did. I did indeed. Two front row center to Paula Poundstone, live at Poughkeepsie. Holly's favorite. I hope she doesn't call us up on stage. That would suck. Hey, you think you could do my job better? I don't know. What's your name, Michael? <laughs> <laughs> I'm really excited for Michael either way, because if Holly chooses to be with him, he will be so, so happy. And if not, he'll be avoiding the biggest mistake of his life. Happy, 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 happy! <laughs> whoa, 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 okay, calm down, breathe. I'm trying. I said breathe. I'm trying. Wait a second. Are you listening to music? What? Shut that off. I'm not, <laughs> no. I'm not listening to music. <laughs> Fine. Just go crazy for a little while. Ah! <laughs> wow. You're good. You're looking good. Mm. 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 Oh, I got you. I got you. Oh, 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 I'm pulling you back. Oh, 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 oh. Michael, dance off. Go. Oh, that's nice. That's go. nice. Me? OK. Mm. Mm. Do we have any of those clips that hold paper together? Staples? <clears throat> uh, David Wallace called. Oh, he did? What did he say? He heard you made a big splash at the meeting. Oh my God, that was so mean what I just said, and I didn't mean it. It was Kevin and Meredith put me up to it. Okay, I'm gonna kill you. You did this? No, I was just check. Yes, I did, yes, yes. Why won't you like him? What is there to like? He's just... He's a weird little skeevy guy with no waist. Why do you care whether we like him or not? I, I care if you like him. Why? I'm not your father. All right. Okay. Go to your room. What? Go to your room, young lady. Um, I'm not going to my room. You listen to me. You listen good. You are not to see that boy anymore. You listen to me. You are not to tell me what to as do. As long as you are living under this roof, you are going to do what I said. I hate your roof. Oh, do not raise your voice to me. I'll raise it I'll raise the roof! I will pull this car over! I hate it! I hate your car! <laughs> See you, Oscar. If you break that girl's heart, I will kill you. That's just figure of speech. But seriously, if you break that girl's heart, I will literally kill you and your entire family. Gabe, just go and have fun with Aaron. But not too much fun. That girl's gonna turn my hair gray. Who's hungry? What is that? It's ants on a log. Michael would always have me bring them in at 2.30 and say, 
Who's hungry? Oh, uh, I'm fine. Thank you, though. Do you want me to spin you in your chair and make you dizzy? Why would I want to do that? It's a thinking technique. All the top executives do it. It keeps the brain moving, and a spinning brain is a working brain. For now, I'm just gonna go back to work here. Oh, sure. Yeah, okay. thank you. Well. Oh, it smells good in here. It sure does. Okay, we have your space heater, your humidifier, your dehumidifier, your fan, your foot fan, and your food dehydrator. Aaron, what about my keyboard? Oh, so good to be home. How about a little bossa nova? Oh my god. What? According to the internet, the tallest man in the world is Chinese. So much for keeping our secrets up high. What's America gonna do? I know what we're gonna do. We're gonna put our best minds on it. God. Erin? Oh. Sorry, I thought everyone was gone. No, no, I was just watching Cookie Monster, finally downloaded. You mind if I sit down? Yeah. What's, um... I can't trust Andy anymore. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry about that. I feel, oh. I'm sorry I caused that thing. It's Andy's fault. Well, yeah, yes, so, but I still feel sorry. Oh, you know what? I wouldn't worry about Angela. She's, she doesn't hold a candle to you, Aaron. She's old enough to be your mom, for one thing, and she's, like three feet tall, <laughs> and she wears pioneer women clothing, <laughs> and, and I don't think she's ever pooped oh. in her life. And Andy, you know, come on. Andy, his butt looks big in those khakis. Oh, I like his butt. You said butt. You tricked me. Ah. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> he said it. Oh, no, you'd love, oh, this. This guy in my neighborhood, Tom Dysmore. Mm. This is him. Hey! hey Sometimes telling someone something is hard. Well, at least somebody made her happy on Secretary's Day. Hey, who's this guy? What you gonna do? What you gonna do in my country? Hey, who's this guy? What you gonna do? Please stop. What you gonna do? 15 lives. I destroyed 15 young lives today. No. Yes. No, there's financial aid. Um, they could join the army or the navy. You're maybe what, they... like 12? The principal told me that 90% of Scott's tots are on track to graduate and that's 35% higher than the rest of the school, so. I think that if you hadn't made that promise, a lot of them would have dropped out, which is something to think about, I think. I think you're doing a great job. Really? What do you want from this job, provided the company doesn't go out of business? Well, I've always wondered what it might be like to be an accountant. Really? Yes, but I'm terrible at math, so. <laughs> you know, when I hired Kevin, he was actually applying for a job in the warehouse. Seriously? Yeah. I just sort of had a feeling about him. I have a feeling about you, too. Hey, Mr. Scott, what you gonna do? What you gonna do? Make our dreams come true. Hey, Mr. Scott, what you gonna do? What you gonna do? Make a dream come true. Yeah. What if we all get together and help each other and hire a new guy and then we all kill him, but first we take out like a hundred thousand dollar life insurance policy? I bet you guys like that idea, don't you? I think that's what they're doing to me. I can't prove it, but I wanted to see their faces when I said it. I learned nothing. I don't know what the f that was.